brain sends neural signals and their electrical signals go from one brain cell, one neuron to another. And when those signals are transmitted, you can record the electrical activity. You can record it very precisely with, with electrodes that you implant in the brain, like these brain computer interfaces, or you can get sort of an aggregate of the brain signals by taking a surface recording. Your brain has 100 billion of these neurons all talking to each other and firing, and you have developed this phenomenally complex nervous system and evolved it to work. But what we have to do when you're just getting little signals, just like a little spike from these neurons, is the computer has to interpret what that means. Huh? This is a similar principle to Neuralink, these ideas that you can help people speak. Uh, I have heard that they're recruiting people who have um, ALS, amyotrophic lateral sclerosis, or, or some types of paralysis. So I'm guessing that in the future, they won't just be using the Neuralink to tell your phone what to do or to move a cursor on a computer screen or play a game, but to actually send the signals to a robot or send the signals to a prosthetic limb.